Fix background container DLL error when booting Windows. If you met the below error message C colon backslash users backslash your username here backslash app data backslash local backslash conduit backslash background container backslash background container dot DLL. The specified module could not be found. Read on and try the outlined solutions below. Solution 1. Make the best of task scheduler. Open control panel. Open administrative tools. Open task scheduler. Alternatively, press the Windows key and the R key, then type tasks.msc. Click on task scheduler library. Scroll through the list until you find background container. Right click on the entry. Click on delete on the menu that pops up. Refer to the below screenshot. Close all windows, reboot your computer. For power users, try auto runs at https colon slash slash goo.gl slash 5f1qpt. Direct download, instead. Create a new folder on your hard drive. You can name that folder as auto runs, c colon backslash auto runs, and extract, unzip, the downloaded file there. Open the folder and double click on auto runs.exe. To launch it. Note number one. For Vista slash Windows 7 8's users, please right click and select run as administrator. Please be patient as it scans and populates the entries. When the utility finishes scanning, it will say ready at the at the bottom and list all entries under the everything tab. In the top menu, click file find. And type the exact file name background container.dll, then click find next. Alternatively, you can scroll through the list and look for any entry related to conduit. Note number two, conduit is related to a stubborn browser hijacker. And we highly suggest running the recommended Avast internet security in this video guide, so that you can clean out potential pup, s, even threats in your system. Additionally, please be kindly advised that Windows Defender is usually pre-installed on Windows 7, which is an anti-spyware program only and it is frequently disabled to prevent conflicts when other real-time security programs such as Average, McAfee, Norton, and alike are installed. Therefore, you really need a full-service anti-malware program instead of Windows Defender. If found, right-click on the entry and choose Delete. Exit auto runs and reboot your computer when done. If problem remains after scanning, take those entries out of startup via misconfig. For Windows 10 users, you just need to disable the startup entry related to background container.dll from Task Manager. To do that, right-click on Taskbar Task Manager Details check out the Startup tab carefully. Solution 2, click.
Registry Editor. Warning, please do backup or export current registry settings before you make any changes to Registry Editor. Start regedit.exe and search, F3 or Control plus F, for background container.dll and delete all entries you find. Tip, please do not miss out on the below setting at hkcu backslash software backslash Microsoft backslash Windows backslash current version backslash run. Other voice, make the... of CCleaner, as it also contains a startup manager.